Good morning, Caitlin and Shelly. As we know, Big Brothers Big Sisters does so much for our community, especially when it comes to mentoring. This morning, I'm joined by Lisa Metcalf. How are you doing? I'm well, thanks. How are you doing? Good. Thank you for joining us. And as we all know, this has been a rough year and a half for everyone. So you guys have had to cancel two years straight of some exciting events that you usually have, which leads to a lack of funding. So is this campaign helping with that? It absolutely is. So what we are doing right now is fund the gap. So one of our challenges has been with obviously the in-person events, but the other dynamic that the pandemic has brought about is been shortages of workers. So a lot of our big supporters for um, our Taste of the Town event are restaurants and they're very short staffed and don't have necessarily the capability to even attend an on-site event, let alone even fill their restaurant in the moment. So um, in order to help support our supporters, um, we did have to make the very difficult decision to cancel this year. Um, it's unfortunate, but we are working to fund um, that gap by doing online auctions. We've got some different um, letter campaigns and, and we're doing a whole um, gap to, or campaign to fill the $250,000 gap. And I think you guys are going to do it. And let's talk a little bit about that gap. I saw that it's upwards to $200,000 that we're looking to fill through events like this. It is, absolutely. Yeah, I mean, the, the reality is the, the events get canceled, but the need is still very much there. Through our mentoring programs, um, our children are 52% more likely to stay in school, 75% more likely to graduate from a four-year college. So we still, the kids are still out there. They still need us, especially now more than ever when they're maybe having to stay home um, due to maybe COVID restrictions or whatever the case might be. So um, our mentors are really imperative um, in, in their lives and that work still needs to continue on. And you guys are doing the work just that and looking at some of these incredible items we'll get to talk about them a little more live in Green Bay. Faith Alford, Local 5 this morning.